and welcome back in the life of the Moors. I am Andrea, I'm the mother of seven kids and the wife to Louis. Um, yeah guys, if you think Sammy is home and she find you wrong, say hi. <laughs> um, yeah, she not so happy and good today. Um, she don't want to look like this no more and out of the fact that she can't open or close the eyelid anymore um, the eye is drying out and it really burns and hurt her so um, yeah we got recommended to go to a specialist that's two hours away from us which I tried to pass one week to make an appointment I finally have one but it takes another five weeks awesome that's really awesome um, till then we have to see what we can do for Samira so we go into our normal doctor now to at least get some eye drops or something to keep her eye moist right Sami? Um, yeah Sami is not so happy right now as I said so I guess you don't want to be on camera no, she don't want to be on camera right now which um, I'm not one of these family bloggers who just hold the camera in the face of my kids all day if they say they don't want to they don't want to and I accept that um, I always ask if they find with the things I post so I accept that Sammy don't want to be on there today um, I hope you guys understand that too so let's drive to the duck I'm waiting with the two small ladies in the car since a good hour. I have no idea when Sammy will be done. It's cold. I have the car running. I have the heat on. I'm getting annoyed. Yeah. Livy? Do you annoyed? No? Yeah, right? You cranky. Two hours later. So Olivia being Olivia, the diva, and um, I'm getting a little stressed out, so I decided, yeah, I decided um, to drive around the block the whole time. wondering why I don't just go in there because I really am a little germophobic um, there's flu and I don't know what right now is going around in this doctor's office sitting there I'm not I don't want to sit beside a flu person or a stomach bug person or whatever um, beside this person in this doctor's office waiting and he breathing on me coughing on me or whatever they're doing mm -mm. I can't have that and then Olivia always gets sick so quick and um, I don't want no sick kids we are about to travel so the only thing I don't need now is someone being sick yeah Six and a half hours later. Something happened in our house. What happened is this. If you subscribe to us and you follow us, you know that Samira got diagnosed with Smyrstenia gravis um, just a few weeks ago, not even, right? No, two weeks. And she been home for one week now from the hospital and we notice now that her whole mouth is hanging down. So it's not only that she have that paralyzed eyelid, no, it went down to her mouth and who knows what happened next so we called um, so we 
So we called the doctor um, where she was in the hospital and they found finally this is not a funny thing now, Aaliyah. This is not the right moment to make jokes. I am stressed um, and worried. Me too. Yeah, the doctor called back and said that uh, she would like Samira to come in right now. They want to make an MRT of her head and they want to keep her there again to see what's going on. Um, yeah, let me show you all the time. Yeah, it's almost midnight. It's minus 8 degree F8 Celsius, which is like 8 degrees, something like that. I'm not sure, but it's uh, very, it's very, very cold. Eight degrees it's freezing. Eight degrees. It's freezing <laughs> outside. It was snowing really bad, so it's icy, it's slippery. I am scared to drive 30 miles now to the hospital in this weather, but we have to. I'm tired guys, I'm stressed, I'm buried, all together, of course. You don't need to be, you don't need to be very good. I am good. very buried, Samira, and you're not good, look at you. And um, yeah, of course, when things like that happen, Louis is at work. Mm. So we gotta go alone, that's why I took Aaliyah in the back seat, because I have to take Mia with me, because I'm breastfeeding. So I need someone to look for Mia when I'm busy with Sammy. Yeah. Let's drive. Hope we get there safely. And let's see what's going on. We made it to the hospital safely. <laughs> Yeah. It is so cold. Oh. So the normal entrance is closed, so we have to go through the special entrance. Exciting! Thumbs, 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 thumbs. Let's go. one hour now 
I just want to go to bed and sleep. Nami, you okay? Two hours later. So they just ran some tests on her and now um, the doctor have to call the head doctor and then we know what's next. 20 minutes later. So guys, the doctor just left. Um, they have to run different tests, which means she got to stay again in the hospital. And we all not so happy about that right now. So guys, it's 3 a.m. Don't ask, we have to drive back home now for one hour. Um, yeah. No Sammy. Sammy got no room, so this poor girl have to sleep in the hallway where the light is right in her face and people walking back and forth. So I don't think she will get a lot of sleep. And now the whole stress from driving back and forth will start all over. And I'm so worried because she just looked terrible, right earlier. That's not what a young girl want. I hope they can fix it. I hope they get it under control. And I hope we make it home safely now. Yeah. Thank you for watching guys. Please keep praying for Samira. Keep sending positive energy to her. Uh, drop a like um, so I know you are interested in getting updated how she doing. And um, yeah, peace out guys. Good morning. Yeah.